today I'm here, and Hans was here a second ago. And Darren's here, that's Hans' friend. I met Hans from New Money. He's just in the toilet right now. As of walking into the Four Seasons Hotel, boys, we saw the best fire in the world, Kamara Usman over there. So it's a small, small world. Anyway, we're here smoking shisha right now. We're waiting for one of my friends to come. She's like 10 minutes away, I don't know where she is. She's coming, she'll be in the vlog. I'm gonna start getting girls in the vlog, show you guys more of the lifestyle when I get up to on a daily basis. Yeah, boys, if you guys like this, leave a comment on what you guys wanna see next. We're gonna take over YouTube, it's gonna be easy. So, all right, boys, we're here with Lizette. So, Lizette's a friend of mine. Tell them what you do at the moment. So, I'm working for Emirates Airlines, and uh, basically, I just landed yesterday from Thailand, and tonight I'm going again to Thailand. And that's what I do here in Dubai. So, she's like air stewardess, right? Yeah. Yeah. Flight attendant. Yes. Flight attendant. So when you're on the f when you're on the flight and you want someone to bring you drinks, Lizette's the girl me. you call. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so. You're 27. How come you're not married yet? How come you haven't got children? Like, what's your dating life like been in Dubai? What are the guys like? Obviously, you're a beautiful girl. Why have you not found love yet? It's so hard here to find someone, you know? Like, I think all the guys, they just want to flash, but they don't want something serious. What do you mean flash? Is in like... Like, like, showing off all right. the time. You mean showing off the girl or showing off, like, money? Everything. Right. Everything. And uh, especially here in Dubai, there's, like, so many beautiful girls. And I think they, they they're thoughts are like, oh, I can have every, every girl because I have money, yeah, yeah. but most of them, they don't have personality. I have both. So I'm okay. But yeah, no, she's completely right. I agree. The thing is, guys, a lot of you guys watching this might think, yeah, as soon as you get money, every girl is going to love you and all these things. But you just heard it from Liz. It's not true at all. There's so many guys with money, but then they struggle with their personality. They're not a relatable person. They're just not a normal human. They just think if they spend 20K in the club, they're going to get all the girls. But like, I mean, you can get girls. Of course, you can get girls. But what is the quality of the girls? I don't know. And yeah, you might get them for one night. If it's not the right kind of girl, you're not going to get genuine, like, respect out of these people genuine love that's the dating game but how come you've not found love so why have you not found one of these genuine good people i think because i'm very focused on myself all the time and uh, i don't i don't like to waste my time so if i feel like someone is making me waste my time i don't like that i don't like bullshit i don't like like guys like you know me or <laughs> so i don't like when they like they just want to show that the, they care about me but it's just because they want me for one night, two nights, that's it. You want someone who's real? Yeah. But how come you not found something? Is there no real people in Dubai? It is. There are. But not I'm not <laughs> Let me ask you this. Do you think you haven't found those people maybe because of the way you portray yourself on Instagram or in real life? Is this the reason? I mean, I know you. I know you portray yourself well, but I'm just playing devil's advocate for the camera. Um, like maybe if you had like a more modest Instagram, you like always covered yourself up, do you not find... Do you not think you maybe would find those husband like, type you men? you mean like about, uh, are you talking about the bikini photos or like... I mean, yeah, maybe, I'm not saying it's particularly bad, I'm just yeah, saying, yeah, yeah, yeah these but... kind of things. Like maybe the guy who's really serious, who's like, you're 27, maybe the guy who's 31 right now is looking at you like, oh, she's my wife. She's beautiful, she sounds nice. And then nice. she's showing the bikini pictures. Yeah, like maybe she's been like fucked on like various one nights and all these things. Maybe that's what he's thinking. Is it? I don't think that's the problem. I think the, I mean, there is no problem, but... <laughs> You're acting like she's 42 and she's single and childless. No, I think that uh, it's because I want to enjoy my life and I don't want any drama in my life. Okay, I, but as, what about... As, as I see, as I see it, like for me relationships are drama. You know, maybe... If it's maybe the wrong like, one. Yeah. But if the right guy came right now and said, look, I mean, he wouldn't just say that. I, want, I want to find a boyfriend if the guy's <laughs> But tell me, tell me. Yeah. What about if he said, look, we're, we're great together, I want I see a future with you, but I don't really like the fact that, you know, other guys can just see you this easily. It's not that I want to restrict you, it's just that I don't like the fact that everyone can see you, like you're mine. I don't want every single man to see you. What about if they said this? In a relationship, there's compromise, right? Just, yeah. like, if, just like how if I was doing something you don't want. I don't know. It has, it has to come with the years. Maybe like if I'm comfortable with him, I'm thinking about being a mummy with him, I will change my, my mindset, you know? I bought this bag just to flex really, like you know when you're at the airport, I was sick of seeing all these fucking losers with the Louis Vuitton bag, always just acting obnoxious and arrogant, so I need to get a bag, so next time I see them with their bag, I can be like, look, look at my bag. Boy, this is absolutely amazing. If I had cash, if I had cash, I'd give a big tip. Alright boys, wait, hold on, hold on, wait, come, come with me. I'm gonna give her a tip. Check how much money I have, boys. 
Alright boys, it's about twenty it's about thirty-five dollars. I'm gonna tip it. That is just absolutely wonderful performance. Us in the Lambo. All right. Say sorry. No. Say sorry. No. Say sorry. No. Say sorry. Say sorry. Say sorry. Say sorry. Say sorry. Boys, listen, she went against the new money army, so she had to pay. <laughs> He's actually super nice about it, I can't lie. I have more respect for her now. All right, boys, so this is me incline benching 40 kg for eight reps. So, in the last vlog we did, or two videos ago, I did 40 kg for six reps and I failed on that seventh rep, but here we go for eight reps. And then the next clip will me be shoulder pressing 60 kg barbell for seven reps which also is an improvement from last couple of weeks. So we're getting stronger, boys. I'm going to keep you guys updated with my gym progress. Let's go, boys. Back to the vlog. Boys, we're on the way to Top Golf right now. I'm with Sham. He works for Craig. And then, obviously, you guys know Craig. And then, these are the whips. Craig's taking the Urus. I'm going to take the Hurricane. And we're playing Top Golf. And I'm eating another girl in Top Golf. We're going to see who's the best Top Golf player. I can't lose. Otherwise, this video is not going up. So, if you see the rest of the Top Golf, I won. <laughs> this Lambo Hurricane is the craziest sounding car in mankind. Listen to this. That's me. Boys, what's more expensive to watch of the car? It's close. It's close. That exhaust is Boys, respect the levels. I take two car park, I take, I take two car parking spaces, boys. I don't park in my lane, I park I take both lanes. Both both caps, both spaces. Oh! Say nothing! Ooh. Guys, the reason why my shots keep going to an angle is because this gold brick protect way so much. He didn't get any in the hole. He didn't get shit in the hole. He likes it.
That's no, no points, bro. No points. Come on, Hassan, come on. He's 50 ahead of you. Keep pushing, Hassan. You're better, you're better. He's th he's come on. Ooh. That was close. Hassan won this one. Oh! That comeback! That comeback, bro! Oh my goodness! Why does it all say sorry? Why didn't you say sorry? Got me in like this. <laughs> oh no. It's angry. 